Hey YouTube family, my camera just kicked on by itself again, but we're not going to talk about that. This is a couple of days later and I literally had to walk away from my closet for several days and go do other things in the house. But I am back because Leon is on his way home and he is going to help me do this. It's I want to also say that going through these projects, you have to, or all the projects that we have going on here at Raphael's Refuge, sometimes you have to get away. So I think this weekend we might be going out of town, maybe uh, going to the races, rent a hotel. Uh, my family are all going to the races to watch T. Wayne, and so we like to do that every now and then. And so uh, they're going to be camping out in their uh, Winnebago's and their RVs. But at a campground, I do believe. Okay, we will be around them. Leon loves to help at the races. And then it gives me time to just be with my family. And we need that. I need that. And so um, hopefully that is going to happen. So we need to get this done because I don't want to leave this undone. So I'm going to be rushing, rushing, rushing to complete this project. about it is I have never wore these belts ever except what do those wires go to so y'all me and Leon's cleaning out and I wanted to show y'all this these shirts we had made A long time ago red which is not my color <sighs> and then my wedding dress is in here also this Saints jersey that we wore on when we were dating on one of our dates that I can't seem to get rid of <laughs> you paint our wedding Stuff. This was my dad's belt buckle, and he loved racing as well. And stuff that you just want to, I don't know why. Should I get, I don't know. You just want to keep. This is what I wore in my hair for my wedding. <laughs> yeah, you open that. You put pictures in there and I never did anyway what I'm doing is going through the clothes folding them and putting them in categories of the people that I want to give them to also for goodwill so I'm just folding them neatly and I'm going to pack them up <music> So what we were afraid to take this out because yeah. this this tile right here it's not wood it's ceramic and we are not sure that they put ceramic underneath this. All right, well we could do that. So we're gonna pull the facing off. If the tile doesn't go underneath it, I think it would be like a huge project 
that I don't want to have to put Leon through. So we might leave that, but we're going to see. Am I the only one that starts journals but never finishes them? This one actually made it through the flood of our house. So this one got wet. And uh, as you could tell, it got wet. It, it made it through the flood, but I, I decided to keep it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, start journals. Probably need to get back into journaling. That's a good way to um, uh, help, you know, work out, uh, prioritize your feelings and stuff. So yeah, I might get back into that. Oh, yeah. Cement. Under there is cement. It is not tile. So we're not even sure we can get the same tile. So we're going to keep it. We're just going to leave it up, you guys. It's okay, so we decided to leave this. And I think I already told y'all in, in another clip why. <laughs> so um, what I'm doing right now is because we had to break this off and then it had, it had to put it back. I'm gonna use this right here to put over that before I paint it. And I've been working through this tub for a while. It kind of got a little dry, so I added water to it, mixed it up, and I'm gonna put that on there. So y'all, we had to come to Lowe's to pick up some paint and another piece of wood to make an extra shelf because all of my plans have totally changed. And so uh, we had to run by here for um, a few uh, items that we need. Okay, the reason I came to uh, Lowe's to get the baskets is because they're made better than Marshall's or I find anywhere else they're made better. They might be a little bit more expensive, I think, but they're made better. So let's see what we can find. Okay, for my sweaters, I do need them deep, but I have to make sure that they'll fit on that shelf. I think I've used this color before. Oyster shell. You wanna do that? That's fine. Alright, we're gonna do oyster shell. Okay.
okay you guys these two baskets right here they have a plastic liner in there that pulls out of course i'm holding my camera so i can't pull it out that easy but they do pull out and they're planter baskets they they were in the section that um the baskets were in but i liked these you get a little one and a big one together and they were not cheap but i thought that they could help me with some of my shoes you know some of my shoes that i kind of wear all the time y'all i purposely put on these pants and i asked leon if he thought i was too old to wear them and he said no this is a pair of can cans they are comfortable though girl you young talking about old <laughs> He, he thinks I need to quit saying that I'm old. You do need to quit saying that. Okay. So, I'm trying to go through my shoes. And um, what had happened was, Leon's filming for me. Because it's hard to film and do this. So, these shelves are short. So, I can't put those big baskets on them. I'm going to go ahead and put my shoes back here. And I got these baskets down here just to handle my uh, sandals and all. And so, uh, just to keep from throwing them on the floor. And over here, I put my um, my sweaters in these baskets. So, they're easy to get to. I can easily pull them out. It's no big deal. So far, I'm putting my purses there, which is all that I have and the one that I'm using. The comforters are up there and the pillows. And so far, I have this uh, going on with the clothes and all. So, my goal is to have one this is where my clothes are going to go instead of over there and down there and then i have some big baskets to go up there for stuff so that's where i'm at right now and i still have a ways to go but uh i feel like i'm moving in all over again literally but it's looking good so far well, when you moved in we just come in and cleaned up and just started hanging stuff just up. just started hanging stuff no, yeah no painting in here right we did a lot of painting in the kitchen and all but we didn't really freshen up you know other rooms yeah and we're gonna get started at freshening up here in the yeah. bathroom itself yeah so. i'm gonna do the bat we're gonna do the bathroom later because uh you know we we gotta rest and so anyway that's where i'm at now these right here, we got these in Tennessee. They're waterproof. They're the Columbia brand. They're furry on the inside. They're, and these are the most warmest boot. So if you live in a, it snows down in, down here, not often, but um, they're still warm when it's real cold. But if you live in a state that snows frequently, I'm telling you, these things right here will keep your feet nice and dry and warm. Okay, another uh, thing. If if I if I had the choice of only having a certain pair of shoes for summer, like if I was limited, if I lived in our RV and I could only have a few things because the space was limited, which we did live in our fifth wheel for two years after our house flooded, so I was more limited. And yeah, I really enjoyed that time. But anyway, um, these shoes right here, the Reef. They come from Academy, so it's the Reef brand, and these are also this, oh gosh, these are so, so comfortable. Feels like you're literally walking on uh, pillows when I wear these. Very comfortable. And Leon went to get us something to eat, because uh, I'm too busy to cook. <laughs> but, um, y'all, I have the best husband in the world he is so supportive of me you know it's uh, it's really scary because i do not know what i would do without him and that's a scary place to be he is just i don't know he you know when he's at work i don't like to bother him you know because he has a stressful job so i don't like to bother him you know over things that would be petty at the time i think is like oh my gosh oh my gosh but really, after I calm down and he talks to me, I usually try to wait till he is home and then just kind of, you know, tell him, pour my heart out to him. And then when he gets through talking to me, I'm like, oh, okay, well, you know, it all makes sense. Um, I'm probably the only one that is like that. <laughs> but um, he is just, 
a wonderful husband, you guys. Okay. Um, I wanted to sit down here for just a minute and, and tell you. I do not know how this happened. Okay. So I have a pair of gray boots. Long. A pair of black boots. Long. A pair of very long brown boots. These are um, suede. And the reason I got these is because when you wear, you can wear these over pants. And these right here, see how floppy they are? They do stay up. I got these off of Amazon. Um, I no longer shop on Amazon, y'all. Because a, a little over a year ago, someone, uh, get, they said when we called the bank, because we've seen a $60 charge on our account that I did not make. So when we called the bank, they said it was either from Amazon or Walmart. And I, I don't shop at Walmart online. So we had to go to the bank and redo our cards and everything. So I haven't shopped on Amazon in well over a year. And I miss it. But anyway, that's where these come from. And then these come from Amazon too. Let's see if they have a name on them. Uh, no, I don't think they have a name on them, but they're really comfortable, but they're very warm. If you wear skirts or dresses and you need something to cover your legs, these are here are so warm. You can find them on Amazon, y'all. I think I actually advertised them whenever I got them. I put a link, but I don't have that account anymore, so. But yeah, <laughs> all of these boots. So what I think I'm going to do is these are wide, really wide little wider than these I believe yeah so I'm going to donate these because these are the same I'm gonna donate these and keep these yeah that's what I'm going to do okay I'm finally finished you guys and I managed I, I cleaned out the clothes a whole lot more and so um, I actually managed to get everything in here I put, um, uh, like I showed y'all, put my, I'm so tired, but I put my sweaters here. This is a dirty clothes basket, extra hangers. Look at all of the hangers, y'all, all of the hangers. So actually, this basket for now is empty. And I may put uh, throw blankets, have a bunch of throw blankets that I don't, I use periodically. I may put those in there. And so, um, I put uh, my pants right here, the skirts right here. I only kept two belts. I got rid of the rest. And these are my um, jackets, my blue jean jackets. And then my long sleeve shirts, my um, undergarments. And then these are my everyday shirts and then my long sleeve shirts. And the dresses that I kept, I just kind of shoved back there. Then put all my shoes up there my boots and then all I did kind of clean those out and the first time ever <laughs> I have actually a space empty right there I have a space empty which is a good thing it's a good thing I hung my hats right here and down here I put oh and I actually did wind up using that for my high heels yeah because I really couldn't fit those up there but here, I just have extra lotion, and then my makeup bag, and then, um, oh, well this needs to go over there. Where did I put this? Some, um, hats and scarves, because, um, uh, I actually thought I had more hats and scarves than that, but I didn't. So Leon's filming, so go out right there, baby, and let me see. Let me see if I can. Thank you. Let me see if I can.
you think? You did a good job. Did a good job? Yeah. Okay, so in this hall closet right Here's here, my that's my gun case. So in, in this closet, I'm going to um, store our beach towels and some, some bags and Christmas stuff. This is uh, my giveaway, my giveaways, and then this is uh, my giveaways. So, yeah. And, and I also put my jackets in this uh, hall closet for now. So I have to organize that tomorrow. I'm going to do that while Leon goes hunting. He's going hunting in the morning. So y'all say a prayer for him. Hopefully we can get a deer. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close out this video, you guys. Thank you so much for joining us in this closet makeover. And I hope it inspired you and encouraged you. Until next time, we'll see you in the next video. You want to say goodbye? You want to say goodbye, honey? Goodbye, y'all. <laughs> God bless.